Cheers from the Pacific Northwest. I am here in Seattle, Washington, the site of the 2018 Special Olympics USA Games. Of course, on Sunday, it'll be the opening ceremonies and the competition itself goes on all throughout the week. I've had the opportunity to volunteer with uh, the Special Olympics Arizona throughout the last four years and they invited me along as a member of Team Arizona, part of the support staff, but as a member of the media as well, I'm going to utilize this opportunity to put together some stories for you and kind of show you a day in the life of many of these athletes. And of course, some of the stories down the line will air on KVOA News 4 Tucson. But for now, I just want to show you the great welcome that everybody from Team Arizona got. You know, we got up early this morning, we left Phoenix. We flew out to Seattle the minute that we got off the planes and at the airport. There was a warm welcome, a welcome with lots of energy. Check it out. So there you have it, lots of energy, lots of positivity, lots of satisfaction in seeing these special athletes have those big smiles on their faces. And the competition begins as well uh, starting next week. And of course, on News 4 Tucson at 10 p.m., I will have a lot more from here in Seattle with Team Arizona and uh, the opening ceremonies. Also, I want to let you know that there's a softball team that won a gold medal at the Special Olympics World Games a few years ago with uh, most of the team comprised of people from Tucson. They will be defending that medal at these games as well. We will follow them. Some of them are from Sunnyside High School. A few others are from Tucson High. Maybe another one also on the team from CDO. And also a team from Marana and Mountain View is also representing uh, the Tucson area. And they were with Team Arizona in basketball. So we're going to keep tabs with them. But for now, reporting from the Pacific Northwest here in Seattle, Washington with Team Arizona at the Special Olympics USA Games. I'm Paul Seacala.